Now that we are into autumn, livestock farmers are preparing to fetch their cattle inside for the winter. This stops the field becoming muddy and the grass being damaged by the cattle's hooves. The straw bedding has come from rolling out the bales you saw being baled at harvest time. When outside, cattle usually just eat grass. To feed the cattle whilst they are inside over winter, the farmer will have harvested some grass. This grass must be preserved or it would simply rot and be no use to feed the cattle. Grass is preserved either as hay or as silage. Hay is grass which has been dried out so it will keep. Hay is often confused with straw. Straw is what comes out of the back of a combine harvester when harvesting cereals. Making hay, the grass is first cut or mown and left to dry. The farmer may turn the grass several times to help with the drying. Once the grass is dry enough, the farmer will then bale it. It is baled into large or small bales of hay. It is important that the grass is dry enough when baled or the bales can heat up and actually catch fire. Silage is also made from mown grass. This time it is only left to dry for or wilt for a day or so. Grass is then baled Wrapped tightly in plastic This weatherproofs the bale and also squeezes out most of the oxygen Silage for a clamp is picked up and blown into trailers by this machine, a forage harvester. This tractor is heaping the grass up and also squeezing out some of the oxygen. The grass, either in a clamp or bale, then ferments and becomes pickled by special bacteria which work best without oxygen. That was why the farmer had to remove much of the oxygen when heaping or baling the silage. Once the farmer has brought the cattle in, we will see them being fed the hay or silage, along with other ingredients to make sure they have a balanced diet.